Good girl. Hey, Bonbon. Bon. The bunny cat. Oh, Lee. You're going to cut the grass for me, mate? I'm going to cut the grass for you, son. That's very nice of you, son. Thank you. I was just saying, I am just saying, I better cut this grass. But I was too knackered to do it. Yeah, I, I, I need to sharpen that, Lee, really. What are you going to do now? Well, see how it gets on. Just, you're going to have it at a high setting, yeah, I suppose. Oh, anyway. All right, mate. Thanks, Lee. What's this coming up here? It's not another lawnmower. Oh, Paul D. Bryan on his new bike. Better start calling him by his proper name. You all right, Al? Can you hear me, Al? Yeah, I can hear you now. Yeah. You all right, John? How you doing? I expected that to be a lot noisier. Did you? Yeah. Northern, what's that mean? Husqvarna Northern. Northern. Means north. Does it? North. North. <laughs> yeah, it's a big old bike. What is it, CC? Uh, 900. 900. I confused it a bit because Lee's cutting the grass and I thought it sounded a bit like a lawnmower, Al. Yes, yeah. Yeah. Oh, thanks very much. <laughs> I appreciate that, John. Husqvarna, yeah, I think I've got... I think they made my chainsaw. Yes, they did, yeah. yeah it keeps fucking up, yeah. Oh, thanks very anyway. much. You're full of compliments today, John. <laughs> oh, I'm afraid I'm not coming out today. No? No. Not very, not very feeling up to it, to be honest. No. And it's bank holiday, I'm telling you. Yeah, yeah. <clears throat> Too, it's very busy out there, John. Yeah, Lee said it was busy. Um, I don't like bank holidays, to be honest, Al. No. You've got brand new tyres. What tyres? Oh, Pirelli, same as me. I put Pirelli's on. Mine are MT60s. Yeah, yeah. What are these? Uh, they're called Scorpion Rallies. They're the ones it's supposed to have, John. Right, are they on and off road? Yes. Yeah. Well, they don't look... more on road. They don't look that much different to mine. No. Pattern-wise. What on your... Um... That's a lovely looking bike. Isn't it beautiful? It's a pity you had to have your toolbox on the back, but yeah. I suppose you've just come from work, have you? Yeah, because you never know. <laughs> that is a lovely bike, mate. How long have you had it? Um, about three weeks, four ah. weeks. You're just getting used to it then? Yes. I've already been to Scotland on it to visit uh, Tommy and Donna. You've been to Scotland? Yeah, to visit Tommy and Donna. Yeah? Yeah. Who, um, and the family up there, you know? So that was in a 640 mile trip up there and 640 mile trip back. Yeah, I know. Well, it's, you know, probably yeah. was the same distance back. Went out with all the family. Big shout out to all the family up there. Do they watch my channel then? Graham and Veronica. Yeah, they, they watch your channel, mate. Because oh. I'll send them the link. Hello, Graham and Veronica. Yeah. And Gav, of course. You didn't do it one go, did you, Al, to Scotland? Yes, one, one hit. 12 hours. 12 hours, oh, you're going quite slowly then? Well, I'm sticking to the speed limit. <laughs> How many miles was it? Um, well, from here to there, it was 635 miles to Tommy's garage. And yeah, so, yeah. And you Done did it in one... 12 hours, left at three in the morning, got there about 3.30 in the afternoon. Yeah. Something like that, yeah. Well, that's I quite a long ride. Times. And this is just when you first got the bike as well? Yes. Wasn't it so a bit that was was his it, maiden voyage? You got you got you you obviously felt comfortable enough to do it in one go. Yes. Yeah, it's quite capable, John. Yeah. It's sort of quite road bias. So no, stand there, stand beside it, Al. But it's quite big. Yeah, it little. is big. Yeah. Yeah, it's a beautiful looking bike. Yeah. Yeah, it's not bad, mate. Oh, I should have asked permission to film it, mate. Sorry oh, about no, that. Oh that's alright. I know you don't mind. Oh I'll be sending this out to a few people, so 
What, what this video? Yeah. So oh. it's got the adjustable suspension for off-road. This is the fuel tank. So the fuel oh. goes in and it sits more at the bottom because I oh. found that if it sits at the bottom more, it doesn't weigh the bike yeah. off-road. So it's not top heavy. Yeah. So it's got adjustable suspension, um, preload and um, shock, and it's got a and a shock like a motocross bike for the shock, and it's yeah. adjustable. Of course, oh, you're you're um you've ridden off-road bikes all your life, haven't you? Yes. Yeah. 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 But you've you haven't all that long ago actually done a road test. Eh? You had, when did you do a road test? What do you mean? Oh yes, um, yeah, May last year. So you've been uh, riding you passed for my test. You, yeah, you've been riding for twenty years, and then you took your yeah, test. Then I did my test. So yeah. hopefully oh, you passed yeah. first time. <laughs> yes, I did. Yeah, well done, mate. Yeah, yeah. yeah. But I quite like the bike because it's um, a lot of this. You see, is just plastic fairing. It's it's very very capable underneath. It's sort of a motocross bike underneath this, but yeah. Do you like the, do you like the fairing? Yeah, but yeah. yeah obviously it's, it's not really doing anything. It's just there to bulk it out. Yeah, but it, well, it could be a bit of wind resistance. Yeah, a bit of wind resistance. It's the same engine as they put in their KTM 890. Yeah, what's that light flash in there for? Oh, that's for my charger. Oh, right. Oh, I see, yeah. For the battery charger. Yeah. And it's got an oil uh, called a Scotty oiler that oils the chain. Oh, right. Automatically oils the chain down yeah. there. Nice mate, it's a lovely bike. Yeah. It's quite clever how they put the fuel tank quite low, so. Where do you, who makes Husqvarna's? Um, uh, KTM, it's part of the KTM group, so. KTM, where are they from? KTM Racing. I don't know, they're just a, they're just a brand of motorbikes. Why don't you just say it where they're from, Al? Why Austria. You... Austria? Yeah. I thought it was Chinese. No, 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 I wouldn't buy Chinese shit, would I? <laughs> no, you can't say that. Oh, sorry. This is, honestly, this is a non-swearing, oh, oh, non-controversial channel. Yeah. Oh, right. <laughs> I'm only joking, mate. You say what you like. Mind you, with the wages that you pay me, John, I'll probably have to uh, buy Chinese in future. Oh, no, just... don't talk about that. Oh. Don't talk yeah. about that, mate, because I'm going to have to put your wages down, actually. Oh, are you? Yeah. Oh, I'm on a pay cut. <laughs> yeah. I've got to see Lee in a minute. He's probably going to want something now he's seen me. <laughs> he's having to think about it while he's mowing the grass. Yeah. <laughs> Why you don't, you're here, Al? Can you just clean you the don't get, out? You don't get much peace around here. Yeah. Yeah, I was going to mention my plumbing, but I won't, Al, because I don't want to spoil your day. Everyone yeah. loves the painting you've done me, John. Oh, good. I expect you want a painting of this, will you? I would love one, yeah. Yeah. So on here, you've got your screen for telling you how fast you're going. You've got a sat-nav there as well. Yeah, can you get, if you want a painting of it, can you get someone to actually photograph you as you're riding it? Yeah. Because I had to make that action oh, right. shot up. Yeah, yeah, no worries, John. And it's really difficult. You know, I should have charged you a hell of a lot more money yeah. than I actually, actually don't know how much. Yeah. Anyway, yeah, it's a beautiful bike, Al. Yeah. Right, I think that's enough uh, talking. Okay, mate. Say goodbye, Al. See you later, everyone. I didn't catch that. I didn't catch it. I wasn't ready. Hang on. Don't go yet. <laughs> I'll keep that in actually. Go on then, Al. See you soon, mate. Ride safe. Here he goes. Thanks for watching everyone. See you again soon. Bye.